So DJI have just given us a new firmware version for this. This is the DJI RC M1 controller and DJI launched this when they launched the DJI Mini 2. Now absolutely tons of you over the past few days have been commenting and reaching out to me to tell me that since they updated the firmware on this device previously when it was launched to support the new DJI Mini 3 that you have been suffering from absolutely terrible connection issues. So it's quite telling to me that basically DJI have now launched a new firmware version. Now the firmware update for this is version 04110200 and they are telling us they have optimized the user experience and improved overall software stability. Now I can only think that when it comes to the controller unless there is some buttons that are not working or they're optimizing something this has to be connection uh, related personally and I, as much as I'm not a huge fan of DJI's uh, release notes I do honestly think that this is going to be something to possibly address all of those that have been complaining of the disconnection after 10 meters 20 meters or we did only 50 meters when flying your drone such as the mini 2 and the dji air 2s or the air 2 for example so i have been out flying the dji mini 2 uh, just to give this a bit of a test and a bit of a rundown um, and quite frankly i was actually quite surprised that when i did my usual test um i did get the same amount of disconnections as what I usually did when I have this little black spot. But overall, um, for some bizarre reason, it just seemed to fare that little bit better. Now, again, I never really had a big issue um, with my previous update um, when I was flying this with the DJI Mini 2 on my previous update video. It seemed to work absolutely perfectly fine, but I cannot ignore the fact that many of you have been having these issues. So the purpose of this video is to update you and let you know that there is a new firmware version for this controller. However, most importantly, I will always stress that whilst it may be with you in your local laws and regulations that you always have to keep your equipment up to date, sometimes safety is first and if your drone is currently working with absolutely no problems with the current firmware that you're currently using uh, with no issues or disconnections I would actually urge you uh, to stick with that it's all well and good updating to the latest firmware but if you are having no problems that is surely uh, the safest way to go but of course if you have been experiencing the recent disconnection issues with your drone using this controller please do feedback to me and let me know whether if you do update whether it has actually fix the problem or of course if it actually hasn't so guys i mean like i said i've been out testing this control with the dji mini 2 and um, had no real issues and it, again just have to point out the mini 2 is an absolute trooper absolutely incredibly strong wins today and it just handled it like a like a boss i do still love this dji mini 2 but yeah please do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below to what you think to this firmware update and what your findings are and if your signal if you were struggling previously has actually improved but until next time thank you very much for watching please do give this a big thumbs up if you found it useful subscribe if you're awesome and until next time see you again soon